becomes a man A man who feasts on the blood of his enemies He is a fearless man He is Dr. Joshuaitz Yes, 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 I have to get started that way somehow. Okay, yes, project your speech. Project your speech. <laughs> okay, no, not good. Not good, not yet, not yet. <laughs> What? It's a conspiracy. It's a conspiracy. Welcome back. Today, we have the hot plate. This is one of the most important purchases I've ever made. This device allows us to record most of the time without clippage, without mic clipping. And sound guys like me a lot. And also, this is the worst part of the, just to be completely honest, is the worst part of the thing, but the DI back here is no good, not very good. But the rest is very good. So without further ado, I'll get right to it. So this has a couple of different options on the outside. You have a bright and a deep switch. Essentially, when you take down any signal, a certain amount of volume, it's gonna have different tonal qualities. So essentially, you're, um, these controls are to even out your signal if there's anything happening when you're lowering the dB, like if it sounds a little muffled or maybe it's a little too bright. You could uh, press the deep switch if it's too bright and press the bright switch if it's too dark. And now there's another switch here that says bulbs on, bulbs off. Essentially there's a bulb in here. So every time the amp compresses, it'll light up. So yeah. All right, so I'm gonna get started. Not connected anymore. Wait. No! 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 Okay. It's not connected anymore. I'm just gonna run straight in and then I'll connect it. So here it is. This is how loud it is straight in. So here's that at zero dB. Uh, it being there takes a little bit of the signal out, but still relatively the same volume. Volume control, so essentially you can get it down to 
speaking levels. So right now it's 16, minus 16 dB. <laughs> So you see what it does and here it is at 16 db almost all the way off like talking level <laughs> another cab so an extension cab and here's your line out don't use this don't, don't do it. it sucks sounds really bad especially for bass not very good but everything else sounds to me i mean it's not that much different it sounds pretty good so you get a good sound or whatever volume we, we, you want it's a pretty good investment to me so uh what are you doing later oh yeah my bad so then I'm using Parts Caster Vintage Jazzmaster Neck MDT Body, Mark Foley Pickups. We got 68 Bandmaster, we got our hot plate, and PRS Vintage 30 in the cab. And we got 846, V846 Wah Wah pedal and seats. Very nice seats. That's pretty much it. Oh, a good piece of information. I've dropped this like from like six feet up on my shelf and shit. So it's, it's good. Good. It's not. It's not a piece of shit. It's good. I've dropped this a couple times and it's fine. So the the light's a little out of whack. Like the glass for the light is a little fucked up, but I mean it works, bro. So. Yakusawi. See you next week. Next week, I'm going to do... Yeah. <laughs>